This project title is IoT based efficient battery monitoring system for EV vehicles. The main purpose of this project is to monitor battery parameters like voltage, current and the temperature. This battery drives EV vehicles like car, bike and buses. Also it reads parameters like temperature, battery voltage and current and upload into IoT server. Also it stores this parameter information into this SD card. While storing information into SD card, it takes date and time from RTC and stores every packet into SD card. Coming to hardware, this is Arduino and its daughter board, 16 by 2 LCD display, ESP32 for sending data to IoT server, RTC module DS1307, battery, for this battery it has negative and positive on positive side we will get 12 volts here we will get 8 volts here 4 volts for showing voltage variations we can use these points this is temperature sensor DS18B20 voltage sensor resistor voltage divider this is current sensor shunt resistance the on off switch for load for showing current we have to apply load here we take load as a dc motor assume this as a vehicle this clip is for voltage reading by placing on different positions like here or here or here we can read different voltages and this is sp based sd card reader and finally we have bluetooth module here actually bluetooth is not required but for rtc module there is a chance to corrupt the time time corrupted then we can set the time using bluetooth app coming to operation power on initially title is displaying after that sd card initialized then after rtc initialized then it shows T for temperature, V for voltage, C for current. For temperature it is showing 30 degrees. We can place near to battery or inside the battery like this to read battery temperature and the voltage and current. Now load is not running that's what it is showing 0 amps. For voltage also it is showing 0. Now it is showing 12.67 that is the battery the total voltage of the battery. If we change from this point to this point it shows around 8 volts. Here 4 volts. If we on load motor is running now it draws some current from the battery around 5-6 milliamps. For every 20 seconds it, it sends data to IoT server as well as it store into SD card. To get data into IoT server, we have to create hotspot in mobile with username IoT server and password IoT server123. Initially we have to create this hotspot setting in mobile and then we have to switch on circuit. Now we will see data in IoT server. You can see data in IoT server like this. These are the battery parameters like temperature and voltage as well as current. Using this we can monitor battery from remote places. Using this information we can protect the battery and we can do services by seeing this data. And also this same data is storing into SD card. We will show that data also. Now I connected SD card into adapter and connected to PC and open this and uh, here a file is created with the name file. Open this and we have the data. So we can see data clearly. Every packet stored with respect to date and time. Now date and time and battery temperature as well as voltage and current. 
continuously storing initially current value is 0 after that 5 3 6 whatever motor is drawing current it is in the milliamps 